Alright. Three. Uh, I want to reconnect. Yeah. We've only got two episodes out of this so far. I think I'll pour myself another whiskey. Well, hurry up and pour it. There we go. Let's save some of this for GTA on Friday. Uh, we're not probably not doing GTA. Makes me sad. Anyways, move on. All right, three, two, one. Welcome back to Character Select, where we are talking to another shining thing floating in the air. It was actually. Thunder and storm. Okay. Which makes no sense because it should be thunder and lightning, but whatever. All right. Man, that's some funky music right there. Yeah, it mm. is. I like it. That beat. All right, you have one big bottle of rocket left, so you're gonna fucking fire it off. <laughs> and you're gonna psi shield all of us. Protected by a psychic shield, by a psychic shield, by a psychic shield, by a psychic shield. By a she by the shield of light, by the shield of light, by the shield of light, by the shield of light. By the power of grace! Holy oh. crap, did you see that? Yeah. Yeah, you should have healed Pooh. He's, he's got she one hit point left. He has exactly one hit point left. Yeah. Somehow. That's why I used the Psy Shield, because I knew these guys were going to hit hard. This music is starting to freak me out, I'm going to lie. Let's see if I can brain shock them. I probably can't, but yeah, it's worth a try. Nope. Whoa! Alright, so crashing boom... Crashing bang boom attack hits really hard, but they have to recover after they use it, so... Sonic boom, sonic boom, sonic boom! It was a terrible, terrible game. I like the song, though. <laughs> I don't know, I've never seen the show, so I can't really speak to it. And I remember the show... From my childhood! Hungry HP Sucker, yeah, try that. All those old video game cartoons, like the Ninja Turtles and... Mario Brothers and that sort of thing. Mm hmm. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. It's a fun show. Yeah, why would that work on you? Well, Jeff might be dying. No! Faster, 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 faster. Damn it, Jeff! Oh. What the hell? He used psych. Oh, shit. That's bad news. God damn it. He used Psy Flash Del or Omega. Yeah, and that obviously never works for us, so. Mm hmm. Oh, crashing boom bang attack. Pew, pew. They do not like psi attacks. Let's keep that up. It's you. funky B. Mm. Keep trying to psi magnet the crap out of them. Do bosses ever run out of uh, MP? PP? They, can, they can, but it's like standard RPG stuff. They have so much that it's not. Hey, we beat them! Woo! It's not gonna ever actually happen unless you specifically try. 64,000 XP. Jesus. Cross. That's went up two levels as a result of that, and got Psy Gaming Delta Gamma. <laughs> I thought your wife told you what that was. She wasn't sure either. Healing Gamma Delta. Who went up three levels? All right. We have learned the utmost in Psy Gaming. So now we found a place. We're walking on a cloud. That's safe. At least you're not walking on sunshine. Whoa! Sunshine. Alright. Well! Ness had a short vision of seeing his mother when she was young. Doll! Soundstone. Uh, yeah, you could totally not take the soundstone with you, by the way. 
It's one of those funny things that you can do. And then you have to, you get to the, your sanctuary places and you have to keep coming back with them. Right. Shh. Okay. I forget. Did they ever explain why we need this stuff? Um, they said that we need the power of the sanctuary points to um, beat uh, Gaigas, but they never really explained why. Yeah, because that seems very a very specific thing to say. It's true. Um, let me do that on the conducting menace. Um, I know that. Uh, it's, I feel like this game is more about the journey than the uh, the actual destination. Like, the whole point is to fight Gaigas, but we gotta be strong enough to do it. So, alright, here comes Psy Gaming Delta. And all the crazy people you meet along the way. Oh god, my <laughs> epilepsy! No! It's kind of impressive, actually. Well, vaporized that worm dude. Yep. And Jeff finally leveled up! And got no and IQ. And no IQ. Way to go, Jeff. Here's a present. Cre credit to Ooh. team. We Racer of Kings. Yeah, that uh, is not for anybody but Pooh. Pooh! Pooh is a poopy king. So it increases his defense by 30. Damn. Jesus Christ! Jobus Mahobus. Whatever that means! Wow, they attacked Pooh from behind and I still got the drop on them somehow. Because Pooh is king! I am the king! Fucker. Not. Uh, it's king, comma, fucker, not king, fucker. I, I, I just. I, I felt that to clarify that. Either way, there's something going on with the king, alright? Something wrong in the world today. I don't know what it is. I do. It's all those damn capitalists. I like that song. What song? Living in the fridge. Living in the fridge, you get something, something, I don't know how the song goes. Ah, Weird Al. <laughs> He's got some good stuff. I feel like he hasn't really done anything recently, though. Have you not seen, uh, Tacky? The what? Tacky. Hacky? No. Yeah, it's a song he did uh, based on, what's his face, uh, the Happy song? Pharrell Williams or whatever. Okay, I don't think I've heard that song either. Yeah, you should check it out. It's pretty good. Yeah, I guess. Right, so now what do we do? Uh, we go unleash the Kraken? Oh, I guess we could go back to Summers and try and cross the ocean. The oceans. But first, there's a deeper ocean green. There's a what? Deeper ocean green. Alan Wake. Oh, you're and you're making references to that are just completely off the wall, and I'm not following your line of thought. I don't have one. Yeah, apparently, it's more like an interchange where everything is crashing irre irreconcilably. <laughs> and don't make fun of my traffic planning skills in city skylines. Oh, we still have to do that. Such a uh, for the game. record, we are planning to do a City Skylines race of some sort. We just haven't figured out the logistics of it yet. And by we, I mean I, because nobody else is figuring it out either. Alright, Summers. Also got a new Kerbal Space Program. Also got a new Kerbal Space Program. Wow. Thought it was going to hit that elephant statue for sure. Alright. We're lucky we don't, like, accidentally teleport through someone and just, like, leave this gaping, nest-shaped hole. That would be awkward. Uh, sorry about that, man! Uh... You okay? Cast, I'm like, sure. Li cast, like, life up on them and it, like, just shoves all their organs back in. Oh god, why? Let me die! My finger is not supposed to be where my heart is. Let me die! <laughs> It's like that scene at the end of Ted, which I can't say anything more about without... It's, uh, spoilers. Now, where is this Captain dude? 
fuck's sake! Oh, it's our we're trying to do two episodes! Wait, where is he? Oh, he's on the boat! He's on a boat, mother- I wasn't he's looking, I had my him. eyes closed because I was like, god damn it. <laughs> Fuck your fuzzy pickles. Oh, really disgusting. That's not even possible because Brian is like super salty and kills mold. Get on this boat, you'll probably see the Kraken and experience but getting seasick. After all, it could only cost you your life, and you got that for free. Luck will determine the outcome of this voyage. So, you wanna sail the skis to the skis to Scaraba? Twenty bucks per person is fine with me, let's do it. You are the most irresponsible person I know. I love the fact that he was so depressed that his wife, or because he hadn't seen his wife in, like, days, and then he finally sees his wife again and he's like, I'm gonna risk my life crossing the ocean, bye! Away! Well, There's time for a nice, relaxing, uneventful trip across the sea. Speaking of funky music... Mm. That guitar, man. I'm just enjoying it. Now, when do we get our airship? No airship in this game. Damn it. It's not that kind of RPG. It looks like a ruin. Can we go visit the... Aww. You know what this reminds me of? Hey, like hey, this... hey, wait, wait. I need to stop the boat. It's been a long time since I was out in the open sea, so I feel seasick. Oh, man, what am I going to do? A sailor gets seasick. So how come you guys are all right? So that bald guy over there. Your buddy, right? He came from Dalaam. Guys must be quite the adventurers. <laughs> I'm feeling much better now. Anchors away! God. Okay. Huh? Sorry, what were you saying? Uh, the art here it sort of reminds me of, like, Star Tropics for some reason. Star Tropics. Speaking of fantastic games that have so little connection to a plot. Oh, that game was amazing. Mmm. 747. Is that a volcano? A uh, volcano. That's for a some reason, volcanoes and video... Wow. That's a weird-looking kraken. Holy crap, it's huge. It's like Quetzalcoatl or something. How do you pronounce that? I always say Quetzalcoatl. Quetzalcoatl. Quetzalcoatl? Quetzalcoatl. Okay. Coatl. Coatl. It's like uh, how they pronounce the original word for avocado. It's like awahadl or something. Awahadl. I don't know how hard this boss is. We can be in for a rough time. Rough seas? Rough seas. Ah, uh, it's, it's funny, because we're on a boat! 10... 218! 273! 268! Fuck me! Jesus Christ. Well... Why did Ness only take 10 damage? Because Ness is like, you know, king. Yeah, I know. No, Yefe. Alright, so we saved Pooh at least. Why do you have a crashing boom bang attack? And why does that never hit Ness who would reflect it back onto you? God damn it. Every time. Because clearly it's like a Dragon Quest VIII, where none of the magic texts ever work on the main character. Right. Because he's got that, like, curse on him. Which I felt was pretty amazing in terms of how they integrated that into the story. Oh, that game was fantastic. So good. Never finished it, but... Oh, the ending is really great! Hard. Oh, I know. But Dragon Quest games, for some reason, are really hard for me to finish. Oh. The dirty socks didn't work on the Kraken. Maybe it's because he doesn't have a nose. I'm gonna side gaming Delta him. I'm pretty sure that's Gamma. He just generated a tornado, apparently. S straight up murdered the crap out of us. Spinning tornado of doom! Yay, we killed it! He did. Once again, tons of experience for everybody but Paula and Jeff. Oh, Jeff. Oh, well. But Jesus Christ, Pooh just keeps, like, zooming wrecking up. it. 
Oh man, I thought you guys were just everyday little kids. You defeated the Kraken and only cost two lives. I also helped in the battle. I threw my slippers at the beast. Maybe you didn't notice. Not really. Or maybe those were the disgusting socks we threw at him. <laughs> Did, were we supposed to follow the... Okay, guess not. That music, though, man. Mm. I think this is the only time it's used in the game, too. Shame. Uh, have you realized that we're about three quarters of the way through the game? Yeah. We've gone from, like, no progress at all for, like, most of the game to three quarters of the way through. It feels like the last two my sanctuaries have been, like, back-to-back, -back, where it's, like... It literally. Between the third and the fourth one was, like, like, 12 episodes or something? Yeah. Well, three took forever. Yeah, All right, I'm looking for the doctors, the doctor slash hospital. We'll use the map. There we go. Oh, you just bumble fucked right into it. <laughs> bumble fucked. That's not a good word. I don't care. It's a good word. Two hundred dollars for the doctor's fee. Well, to be fair, that's a lot cheaper than you know most medical bills could be. Most actual medical bills. Yeah. I was in a car accident a while back, like ten years ago or something. That's that's just a while back. It was just yesterday. Probably remember it like it was yesterday though. Anyways. Uh I was completely uninjured. But I had a thirteen hundred dollar medical bill. Because yeah, you have to pay for the ambulance to haul you to the hospital, even though you tell them, I feel fine, I don't want to go. They just want to take you there just to be safe. But they charge you anyway. Mm -hmm. uh, $30 oh my for God. an IV, no uh, noodle, IV needle Yeah. that was never used. Uh -huh. $30 to stick me with a needle. That you didn't even get. That I didn't even need. Big bottle rocket. Jeff's going to lug that around, because Jeff needs all of them he can get. Shove him up a bullfrog's ass. <laughs> what about Super Bomb? Super Bomb can be thrown, but it's not as powerful as a bottle rocket. Anybody can throw it, though, which is why it's more expensive. Only Jeff can use bottle rockets. I'm yeah. pretty sure there's actually a stronger bottle rocket, too, called a multi-bottle rocket, which does four digits worth of damage. Super! Kraken, the evil sea monster, is now gone forever! I wonder why. Probably not because some kids kicked the crap out of him. No, it was the courageous sea captain. <laughs> Who threw his slippers at the beast. Exclusive pictures. It's like, uh, yeah, from <laughs> the, the photography guy. I wonder when he's gonna show up in this town. Oh, God. Next time on character select, we're gonna find. Oh, Tyler's gonna take over, and we're gonna find the photography guy. Yay. Yay. Also, we're going to sweat our balls off. Well, not as bad as that desert. Nope. As bad as the desert. We're already sweating. You're sweating. <laughs>